Um, <laughs> like, why? I've been reading some, like, textbooks and research papers and stuff for school. Uh -huh. And I was recently reading a paper about one of the AI systems they use for NPCs in Final Fantasy XV. Oh, and really? it is really funny how much more advanced that shit is nowadays than it was in this game where they, end, they just fucking wander in circles. Bees? Bees? Yeah, so the Roxas tournament's supposed to... The yeah. tournament was supposed to start, but Roxas just fucked off into an alleyway and started to... <laughs> started to, started, started just, like, eating bees by, like, the fistful. It was really scary. I got scared. He started converting bees into money, and... That's actually how the Nostalgia Critic opened his recent episode, was he just, like, ate a fistful of bees. Really? Like, this movie's so bad! This movie's just... so bad, it makes me want to eat a fistful of bees! <laughs> he just, like, shoved a bunch of bees in his mouth. So, guys, I want to say that's, uh, scared. that's, like, six episodes? <laughs> six episodes? For the last, they're probably, like, four or five episodes of the first mention of him. Yeah. Probably gonna go, um, let's go to the Sandlot. It's probably gonna be... Are, him? Are you talking about that guy with the glasses? That, yeah, I'm talking to, you know, that guy with the glasses. Um... What a dumb name. Everyone's got fucking glasses, idiot. You're not special. Yeah, I've got glasses. I got, I'm wearing them right now. Fucking dork. I'm not wearing mine. But... Fucking dork. Dork ass loser. I'll kill you. I'm not, I won't. I won't. I didn't mean it, Doug. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it, Doug. I'm sorry. Sorry, Doug. Doug, if you're watching, which you probably are, we didn't mean it. I got. I watched an hour of your commercial thing. And they'll start the tournament. What do you mean? Listen oh, to the yeah, referees the... explain the rules. Who the fuck are you? Is that the referee? Uh, yeah, I yeah. better listen. Rox is like, all right, right, fine. Yeah, sure. You already know. Guys, the I'm gonna check the recording. Camera. I'm gonna check the recording, guys. I'm gonna eat a hot sauce packet. Don't do that. This is like the what? time you're like, like, I'm gonna eat ranch. <laughs> it's easy. The most the fucking Ohio ranch? ass. Remember the time? The, bre the bread that tastes like soap. Yeah, I remember the bread that tastes like soap. <laughs> it's like the first fucking 30 seconds of the recording yeah. session. We said, hello, well, everybody. You said, one. guys, I've got two questions. Is it normal <laughs> for bread to taste like soap? And it is, is it okay to eat it a little, a little bit, bit of poison? It tasted bad. It was a really bad muffin. I think I didn't eat it fast enough. <laughs> is it okay? You each got 100 orbs. Orbs. Your opponent's orbs. Orbs. That's all you have to That's do. All. That's all the rules, guys. That's it. Here's the. What if you, you you you? What if there was a sport event where all the rules? There were two rules. One rule There's was you have 100 orbs, and the other rule is to win, remove everyone's orbs. Yeah. That's all the rules. By any this means necessary, remove the orbs. Land a hit, and your opponent will drop orbs. But if you're hit, you'll be the okay. one losing orbs. Keep collecting orbs, and the match is over. The person with the most orbs wins. So it's literally just a fight, but you just beat just, the shit out of each other and you absorb each other's orbs. Yeah. All right, I'm ready to fight. What do you have to say about this, Pence? Hainer loses, loses cool. cool easily. He opens himself up to attack. Watch for your chance, and you should win. Just don't tell him I said anything. Hey, here's the thing, Roxas. You know our friend Hainer? That guy fucking sucks <laughs> and is an idiot. And he has a short ass temper. He has a short ass temper. Talk shit about him, and he will immediately throw. He will fold. He will not know what to do. I hope you bought potions and stuff. You'll need them when fighting Hayner. Hayner's really no, strong. Won't. I don't know his weakness. I will not. I'm just gonna kill you, him. You won't need potions for Hayner. Okay. Oh, you should equip guard though. Yeah. Roxas. Is oh, you, oh, you can't. Never mind. I don't even. Oh yeah, I don't have the AP. Yeah, you'll, you'll, you'll they gave a, me you'll an accessory with some AP on it for that fucking hundred times I pushed that card up the hill. Well, no, they they just gave you plus one AP. Oh, they gave me AP directly. It was AP. Yeah. Never mind, guys. Ignore like, what I just said. I'm ready to fight. It was right just. It was, it's, it was basically a free, not free. It was basically an AP up. Yeah. Which is good. That's actually a really rare item. Yeah. You should also always give AP ups to Sora. I never follow the Goofy. Fucked on the Goofy. But that, this isn't about them right now. This is about Roxas. This is about Roxas. Roxas hey, looks really sad. About yesterday. What? You still worried about that? I got over that real quick. That was just grouchy. Listen, Hainer, before we beat the shit out of each other with these bats, I just want to let you know I've been really depressed lately. I like that they made up really quick. 
That's nice. Yeah, they're just like teenage boys and they fight sometimes. But, yeah. Like, they're like, nah, we're, we're fucking buds. We're cool, we're cool. Cool. They're now besties, don't worry about it. Other. How do you feel about Roxas so far? Do Roxas like seems fine. He's a little bit... I don't really understand his deal yet. Yeah. I understand. The rules of struggle are not complicated. He's, he's going through some stuff right now, though. Like, weird stuff's happening to him. Weird stuff is happening to him. Um, he's not Sora. No, he's not Sora. But, uh, you know, he's more of a sad teen. He's got a little more... He's a, he's a little bit more like introspective. A little more, there's some more, some more texture, maybe. Roxas is thinking a lot more than Sora ever did in Kingdom Hearts One. Yeah, Roxas is like, yes, but also somehow is less mystified by all of the incredibly strange things happening. <laughs> he is to him. like Sora was like, what the fuck is happening? You're kicking Hainer's ass, by the way. That's because Hainer sucks. His fighting style is very strange. The way he holds his sword. Hainer, you don't even have any orbs. There's no orbs. <laughs> no orbs. No orbs. I mean, I should just like dodge. I don't even like. You got five seconds left. Painter's got no orbs. Yeah. The the logistics of this game are kind of crazy to imagine them like holding a hundred orbs in their hands. <laughs> like just like yeah, I don't really understand how this would go down IRL. I don't know if you could hold a real world struggle match. <laughs> now people do like real world quidditch. Yeah, we have real world IRL yeah, real struggle. Real world struggle. Oh my God, oh. Hainer is perished. Nah, he's just being being a team. <laughs> Rox is like, all right, Hainer, that's good. Oh, Hainer. Yeah, well, I didn't, wise guy. <sighs> Let's find a way to cheer you up. Hainer, get out of here. They are teens. <laughs> hey, oh, what, are you, what are you doing here, Vivi? Vivi's like, all right. <laughs> You're really freaky. I do not. <laughs> oh. It's them fighting now because it's a tournament. It's a tournament. Vivi. You're just. You're not a human. You're some kind of creature, but everyone is fine with it. Well, maybe enemies. there's a person in there. I don't know that, but you it's... would love VV, by the way. You've told me this before. Yeah, like everyone adores VV, but you would really like VV. VV's a freaky critter in this game. <laughs> it's a classic uh, black mage design. Yeah. Whoa. VV gets so tough. Whoa, VV got fucking legs, guys. Our fight went nothing like this. Whoa. No, Vivi! Whoa! Oh, Vivi fucking assassinated him! I'm not sure what just happened. Vivi just fucking one hit KO'd Holy Cypher! Shit. Vivi fucking killed Cypher! Cypher's like, well. Cypher's like, I just got beamed by a fucking four year old. He's like a little critter. Thrash him. Thrashing. Hey, what are you guys doing? They're leaving. They're just, they're just leaving. They're just being salty. They said that's not VV. No, it's probably some kind of freaky creature hidden inside that Final Fantasy character. Yeah, Cypher and those two are like the bullies of FF8. Like, so. uh huh. From the struggle for third place. So I'm in third now? Oh, baby. <laughs> Zayner. Oh man! Oh baby! Yeah, baby, let's go! Fucking go, let's do it! Oh baby! Guys, it is important to say frequently. Never forget that lesson. It's just so funny that they aged like Squall up, and he's like twenty something now, as opposed to being seventeen. Yeah. But then they took Cipher, who was also seventeen in FF8, and aged him down to like fifteen. Yeah, and he's like a it's lame, like, he's a he's fucking stupid he's like bully, he's called, he totally like, owned you lamers. Like, Cypher and Squall have nothing to do with each other in the Kingdom Hearts universe. I'm ready. I'm ready. Keep it clean, fellas. This is the Go finals already? Yeah, the winner gets to fight Setzer. Oh, shit. The match you've been waiting for, Roxas versus Vivi! Oh, shit. I have been waiting for it. Well, now I'm a little nervous that... 
There's some sort of... It appears to be one freaky Kingdom Hearts critter, but in fact it might be another unrelated Kingdom Hearts critter. There's like there's like layers going on here. Now you still have the intro. You're you're oh he's freaking out. Ugh. Remember to air you'll recover. Oh yeah. Ugh. Jesus Christ, the fucking like thud. This critter's freaky. Whoa. I would watch the sport. Yeah, if it, it, if it just- down. I would totally watch a sport that's just people hitting each other with like big foam bats. Yeah. This was probably on like fucking Wipeout or something, I don't know. Yeah, that sounds kind of fun. You ever watch Wipeout? I uh, think was obsessed with Wipeout. We were not obsessed with it, but definitely it was on TV sometimes. We like watched it all the time growing up. Uh -huh. Those big red balls. Yeah, of course. Hey, so Vivi Vivi's just like, gave up. Vivi's dead in the water. <laughs> I lost. I lost. You got a weird voice. Look at him flipping around. Whoa. He sure seemed like Vivi to me. Oh, never mind. Sora, Sora, no, not Roxas has become polygons. Time fucking froze again. Nominate. Oh, but Vivi's moving. Um, it wasn't me. I'm not Vivi. I'm actually, uh, a pillar of light. Never mind, it's Pepsi Man. It's again. Pepsi Man. Pepsi Man again? Again? Ugh, oh, Pepsi Man. Again? Again? Okay. Like, Roxas is getting real sick of this. Roxas like, is, God, God damn, damn it. it, I keep <laughs> passing out in public and... Yeah. Pepsi Man, <laughs> Pepsi Man, I keep dreaming about this, this crit, this anime boy with all sorts of zippers and then... <laughs> and then seeing that I'm gonna fight Pepsi Man, I get a big key. I'm getting pissed. Sora's from the Zipper universe, this is the, the, the Velcro universe. Oh, that's the difference between them, yeah. Yeah. You ever think about how weird Velcro is? I actually saw a video the other day that was like... It was like, um, how Velcro works, like, like, magnified, and it's really freaky looking, actually. It's like little, tiny little like strands little that, like, lock into each other, right? Yeah. And there's just so many of them going all sorts of different directions that they just stick together. It's freaky. No good. That's why it's so pointy when you, like, rub it against yeah, your skin. Yeah, yeah. I feel like as a child you interact with a lot of Velcro, but as an adult, nah. I haven't interacted with Velcro in a while. All right. fight, fight, fight. Oh, no. <laughs> what? Oh, it's him. Who? I really don't remember. It's me. You oh, know. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, there Axel. Hi, Axel. Roxas is like, who the fuck? Blank or the capital B. Man, oh, man. Even the dusks aren't going to crack this. Place. Wait a sec. Axel. Tell me what's going on. This town is his creation, right? Which means we don't have time for a Q&A. You're coming with me, conscious or not. Then you'll hear the story. I'm here to abduct this this boy. <laughs> I'm taking you with me, Roxas. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Roxas is... What's going on? This is stupid! You're stupid! You're stupid! Oh! Number 13. Roxas. What? The Keyblade's chosen one. Axel, what are you talking okay, about? Okay, fine. You asked for it. I guess I'm gonna beat you up. I don't really know who you are, but... <laughs> hey, Axel. Oh, it's good to see Axel again, though, isn't it? It is good to see. I do love Axel, but... Oh! Yeah, it's Axel in like a real game. Yeah, I know. <laughs> There's no cards. Just, you just fight him regular. You don't need to look at the bottom left corner of the screen and regular style. flick through your deck. Just regular style. Oh, Axel. Air the recover. I have, a, I have a lot of trauma with Axel. I know. There you go. There's Scan. I killed him. I'll let you see enemy health. Thank God. I don't know why they don't just give it to you. I don't know why either. Why it's a whole ability. Hello, everyone. It's me, Diz. 
That's just like, god damn it. All right. Time to kill Diz. <laughs> Roxas. Roxas. This man speaks nonsense. Don't listen to him. Roxas. Don't let him deceive you. Everything Roxas. that's happening right now is normal, Roxas. Roxas. This is normal, Roxas. Painter. Pence. Olette. There you go, Roxas. You You're go. fine. You're normal. I snapped out of it. This teen is like having like fucking what? mental breakdowns, and everyone's just like, "This is fine." Roxas keeps fucking blacking out. <laughs> you okay, Vivi? Oh, Vivi's like, "All right, well, I'm gonna leave." Well, that I guess that's weird. Ladies and gentlemen, Roxas, our new top struggler. Roxas is like, guys. Guys, there was this really cool good. anime guy. He was so cool. He had... And then a mummy showed up. And there was a mummy. I don't understand why you are here. Roxas is not okay right now. It's not good. None of this is good, Roxas. That's why it's called struggle. Roxas is having a panic attack. <laughs> Yeah, I'm ready. Let's do it. Oh, you said no. Fuck you. <laughs> I am ready to fight. You two play fair now. You're at the top of the bracket. There's only room for one here. Well, I am an adult man. <laughs> I am like 30 years old. He's wearing his coat like a One Piece character. Rucksack. How about Rucksack. It's immediate. You're asking a child to throw the match? Let me win, and I'll make it worth your while. Get real. Roxas, our underdog hero, oh, such a piece of shit. Champion. Yeah, I don't really understand his role in this world. He's just like a like a kind of a slimy, just like a adult. He's got a skull on his belt. He, he does, yeah, and he's got like the skull little on his big coat. His cape that he's wearing. Shut up. 